the kids are all fabulous. They're all, you know, joyful. Right. What we're trying to do is protect their joy. Uh, and so mm -hmm. we like to get mm -hmm. the kids, you know, when they're little and keep the joy as they grow through our program. Um, yep. We get kids who come in middle school or kids that come in high school. And if they've come from um, the public school system or a traditional school system, and the reason they're looking at us, for, you know, is because they now understand that they need something totally different. We uh -huh. go through that process of de-schooling or, you know, decompression right. where, you know, unfortunately things got so bad for them and they don't necessarily have that joy left or that spark for learning and, and, and we're trying to put that back in. Um, mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. joy, the word joy is actually in our, you know, sort of, fa you know, foundational documents right now to say mm -hmm. that that's what nice. we're trying to protect and that's what we want. Um, the, the staff that comes to us, the people that come to work for us, uh, tend to be joyful and pick up on the joy that we are trying to, uh, mm. you know, to create. Uh, we've worked really, really hard over the last 15 years to create a culture of joy and say that that is nice. really important to us. And what are the components of that? What are we asking you mm -hmm. to bring? What are we promising you that will help you protect that? This is the Agentic Schools Podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.